Hello everybody, Hooded Cobra Commander 788 here and welcome back to another 90s quick shot. This is a brief look at a G.I. Joe toy from the 1990s. I'm doing these quick shots every day for the rest of the year 2020 to finish out our year of the 90s. This time we're looking at the 1992 Barracuda, one man attack sub with real diving action. This vehicle may make you think of the song Barracuda by the band Heart. At least it should. Don't be heartless. G.I. Joe didn't have many submarines. One of the rare examples is the flying submarine The Shark from 1984. The Barracuda is primarily blue and black with yellow highlights. It includes three yellow torpedoes, two of which can be stored in these slots up in the front and one can be fired from this launcher in the back. Remove the top section to reveal space for one action figure. It also has this yellow cap here that can be removed, and it has space for a round tablet. The vehicle came with what they called dive action tablets. They were made of baking powder, and they would cause the sub to dive underwater and then rise back to the surface. Putting the cap back on takes a little effort, but it will snap back on there. This would be a great vehicle for Torpedo or Wetsuit or one of G.I. Joe's other naval characters. There's a variation on the Barracuda, some examples had the blue and black colors reversed, so the parts that were black are instead blue and the parts that were blue are instead black. That was my quick look at the 1992 Barracuda. I hope you enjoyed it. This will eventually get a full review on my channel and we will see if it can still dive like it used to. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up on YouTube and subscribe to the YouTube channel for G.I. Joe Toy Reviews. I'll be back tomorrow with another quick shot of a 1990s G.I. Joe toy. Until then, remember, only G.I. Joe is G.I. Joe.